Hello and welcome to another really interesting video where I do really interesting stuff and in this video I try and buy everything in GTA online and see how much money it costs and um yeah let's see how it goes also I'm sorry for the kind of shit mic quality like you got healers are humming in the background that's mainly because I've got my PC's quite loud but also uh, I want to get a new mic but most of the good ones they're all out of stock on Amazon because of coronavirus and not coming back in stock for a while so you're gonna have to deal with this sorry guys so the first step is because I've already got another character that has some stuff in I'm gonna make a new character so I can start afresh and then just buy absolutely everything so uh, here's the really cool character that I made So the first thing to do is to buy all the houses and the most expensive ones obviously because I'm trying to spend as much money as possible and uh, if you see in the top right um, you can see my money we're on 750 million that is because um, I play lots of team death matches and uh, it's really legit I swear. Uh, now I was pretty stupid when I first started this I thought Maybe I'll go to the ammunition and that would be a really good idea because, you know, guns, they cost a lot of money. We can get a lot of work done. But, um, yeah, I quickly realised that and then I just decided to buy some expensive stuff. So first I start off with buying the casino and then obviously you get the most expensive stuff. After that I buy all the foreclosure stuff which is clubhouse, facility, bunker, yeah, and then um, they get the CEO office. Obviously the most bank because it's the most expensive. I also get all three garages maxed out. Now that I've got all the properties, I work on buying all the Vegas vehicles and oh my god there's a lot so uh, enjoy this cute time lapse. So I've pretty much done all the packages of vehicles, just had to buy this yacht, and then it was time to buy all the cars, which I I did not realise that there was this many cars in the game. In fact, it turns out that there's 650 separate controllable vehicles in this game, and Rockstar's way of buying them is absolutely terrible. It takes forever. So uh, yeah, you'll see what happens.
now this is what I was talking about. Literally, like, you scroll down to the bottom, and it takes so long to load in. I've got a pretty fast computer as well. I'd already bought most from this website, and there's still about 40 left to buy. And honestly, I could not carry on any longer, because I'd literally been at this for an hour and a half, just constantly doing the same thing. My fingers were getting tired. Boo-hoo, so hard. But seriously, it was just incredibly boring. And I couldn't be bothered to do it anymore. But I also didn't buy all the Super San Andreas Auto Cars. That's about 70 mil. So I'd spent about 460 mil so far. And then if we add on the 70 mil from the other cars that I didn't buy, that's 530 mil. Also, another thing is clothes. I don't know what happened, but for some reason, Rockstar's changed it. Where buying clothes is extremely laggy. Like, it takes a second or so for your purchase to process. And I was already really tired at this point, so I just couldn't be bothered. But that's about, I'd say about 50 to 100 million clothes. Let's, let's say 50. So if we get a calculator out, and we started at 750 million, and we ended up with 277 million, so that's minus 277 million. That's 473 million spent. And then we add the 50 million that might cost for clothes, probably a bit more, maybe a bit less. Add the 70 million for Southern Syndra Super Autos. That's 593 million. Now, this total doesn't include a lot of the things that you can unlock. There's a bunch of other stuff that I just couldn't buy because you have to actually play the game to unlock it. Also, it doesn't include car customizations. That number would be like way higher with car customizations. So, one shark card, the most expensive one that's $100, that gives you 8 million. And with a total of 600 million, we'll round it up. It's more than this because there's a lot of stuff that you can still get. But let's just say you bought most of the basic stuff. 600 million, divide that by 8 million. 75 shark cards is what you need. Now, 75 times 100 is $7,500 worth of shark cards, which is it's quite a lot. It's quite a lot of money. And you must be kind of crazy to spend that much. Now there must be someone that's worked out how much money you can make an hour. So you could work out how many hours that costs. How many hours that you're never going to get back in your life, but yeah. Um, the professional could buy it all because he's got like a billion. I kind of have hired this video. I didn't buy everything because it's so boring. I didn't realise it, but uh, drop a like for the effort. Yeah.